Hey guys, welcome, it's Pig here, and today we're going to be looking at your StarCraft Remastered hotkey setup as a Terran player. Now, there's no definitive right way to set up your hotkeys, you've got to figure out what works best for you, but I'm going to be showing you guys my hotkey setup and how I make it work for me. First things first, in case you've heard a little bit, but you're not too sure about how the hotkey customizations work in Remastered, you cannot change control groups and you cannot change camera locations. They are set. All you can change is these things right here in front of me. So I'm going to walk you guys through my setup, and it has basically just been following the philosophy of grab all those hard-to-reach hotkeys on the right-hand side of the keyboard, bring them over to the left-hand side of the keyboard where your hand normally sits, make it just really easy to reach and minimize that hand movement, while also making sure we don't accidentally have any clashes between those. So let's go through little bit by little bit. First things first, I have changed um, I have changed patrol to X across all my races. You use patrol um, to target fire units and a little bit like attack moves sometimes as well. Uh, you know, due to the, the AI, the specific functions for hold position, attack, stop, and patrol. Patrol though, by nature is on P, it's really hard to reach, so throwing that on X makes it really easy for me. Um, other than that, I've also changed the build basic structures to D, build advanced structures to F, just bringing those over a little bit closer from B and V to make them easier to reach. Let's look at the basic structure hotkeys and have I actually changed those much? Command center, I've just left on C, nice and easy to reach. What have I actually changed here? Uh, not a lot, these are all really good hotkeys. I found them all really easy to reach. Only one I changed was bunker because it was on U, so I've made that F. So if I want to build a bunker, it's just D to select basic structures and then F. Pretty simple stuff. In advanced structures, likewise, I've left most of them. The only one I've changed is the science facility. Took that from I, and I moved that to C. Moving on through the units. Haven't actually changed too many things here. Uh, cloak. I, I, you know, was, was good by default. Lockdown. Okay, lockdown was on L. So this is a ghost ability which locks down mechanical units. Um, really good, really good spell uh, in certain situations. So um, W is, uh, is what I've put that to make that nice and easy to reach. Likewise, nuke on N, Ugh, hard to reach. I've taken that and put it on F. So definitely customize these two hotkeys. With the medic, haven't really changed um, changed her stuff uh, at all because uh, they're all pretty easy to reach, A, R, and F. This is a big one, guys. Vulture is one of the most important units as Terran. I've taken spider mines from I, put them on D. This is one of the most important abilities in the game as Terran. You need to customize that hockey and make it easier to reach. So D makes that so easy for me to spam those mines everywhere. Siege tank, I've taken siege mode from O, which was so hard to reach, it was such a pain trying to move your siege lines forward, and I've put that on E. Same for uh, turn it from siege mode to tank mode, so that makes your life a thousand times easier. Moving on to the flying units over here, uh, what have I actually changed? Okay, unload. Unload all, I've changed to D. Made that way easier to reach, uh, U was crap. And load, which was on L, I've put on E. I'm not sure if you ever actually use this to micro, uh, I use that a lot for my drop pickup micro in StarCraft 2. Haven't had a chance to test it out much in, Star in, in StarCraft Remastered. Figured I'd just put it on a nice, easy to reach hotkey. We'll see how much I actually make use of that. Battle Yamato Cannon? <laughs> Battle Cruiser Operational. The Yamato Gun or Yamato Cannon. Um, default hotkey is Y. Bit hard to reach. I put that on F. Made it nice and easy. Excellent. With the Science Vessel. Most of the spells were uh, by default pretty good. I just took a radiate, which was on I, put that on W, made it very easy to use. All right, let's go down to the structures, guys. Uh, don't think I changed too much down here. Just the nuclear silo, I changed to N, uh, to F, sorry, from N. And uh, I mean, I could technically change the liftoff hotkey, but it's pretty rare. So yeah, if I want to, I'll revisit that later. Um, yeah, I haven't really had to move any bases around in StarCraft Remastered yet. I'll probably come back and, and put that on something like R, make it nice and easy to reach. Uh, not R, because that'll clash. Oh my god, I can I can probably set it now. I'll, I'll set it later. I'll figure it out later. It doesn't matter. Such a niche thing, it doesn't matter. Uh, build a nuke. I've made that F as well. So I've made it nuclear silo, build nuke, and cool down nuke all on F. Um, all right, so that makes sense. From there, I followed the same philosophy across all races of, with the upgrades, I want them to be Q, W, E, R, you know, QWERTY, basically following that top line of my keyboard. So you're gonna see across all of them, Q, W, E, R, actually Q, W, E, R, F is how I like to do it because T starts to get a little bit further over. 
Um, so I want it to be nice and easy to reach. If we click on the machine shop, QWER, Armory, QWER, it's, it's the same across all of them, um, same crap. So uh, other than that, we've changed one of the other biggest hotkeys, Build Marine, by default is on M. Get out, get out, that is disgusting. Um, I've put that on A, way easier to reach, funny story. Uh, you guys may have heard of 4GG, one of the most successful StarCraft 2 pro gamers uh, a few years ago before he had to go join the military. He actually took his StarCraft 2 hotkey for the Marine and rebound it back to M because he was so used to that from Brood War, which is one of the most disgusting things I've ever heard. But it just goes to show how hard it is to break old <laughs> habits. Um, yeah, yeah, kind of gross, but kind of hilarious at the same time. I do miss 4GG. Hope he comes back when he's, when he's done with his, uh, his military service. For now, factory. Another big one is Vulture on V. A little bit hard to reach. This is a unit you need to spam a lot. So I've taken that and put it on A. So Vultures and Marines, the unit you spam a lot of. They're both on A. Siege Tanks on S. T was not too hard to reach, but I figured why not make it even easier to reach? Why not? And Goliaths are still on G. Uh, machine Shop, just the same. Still on C. Starport, I don't think I changed any of these Starport units, let me check. Um, <laughs> okay, I did change the Valkyrie to F, just in case I need them at some point, um, because Y was a little bit hard to reach. Um, otherwise, I think I've gone through every single thing. Yes, I have, guys. So that's it, that's my setup. Uh, hopefully this has helped you out. Uh, you can see it's very simple. Upgrades, because there's so many random upgrades, I like to do that, that thing where I'm like, okay, Let's just make sure they're all, they're always in the same order so I don't forget them, you know. Let's make sure this actually makes a lot of sense and, um, yeah, that makes it easy to learn. Oh, physics lab. Last one. I forgot to change this the other day. I was thinking about where to put this. Um, on P is really crap. So the physics lab on your, your science facility, you, you want to change that. Um, right now, I'm literally just going to pull a random hotkey out of my butt, guys, and just going to say D. D, there we go. Super easy. Save. Anything that's on that left-hand side of the keyboard works in most of these scenarios, and uh, and that works for that. So anyway, thanks for watching. Um, those are my hotkeys for Terran and StarCraft Remastered. i got to say, being able to build vultures and marines on those hotkeys, as well as being able to drop spider mines over on, on the left-hand side of the keyboard and being able to siege and unsiege tanks on the left-hand side of the keyboard, these have been life-changing for me. They have made the game so much more fun because my hand's not constantly having to jump from side to side of the keyboard. So if you change nothing change the vulture ability the siege tank ability and the hotkeys to build marines and vultures they are the most important things you got to change um hopefully you guys enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching don't forget to like and subscribe there's a protoss and a zerg video out there as well just check my channel and uh thanks for watching don't forget to hug a watermelon kick a walrus and of course punch a garden gnome to the moon i'll see you guys next time goodbye and good night